Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new WWE Superguard video, episode 129. In this episode, we're going to go and claim, we're going to finish the Matt Hardy and the RTG, then we're going to claim it. I'm going to quickly show you guys how many points we are on right now. 250 of 270. That is about a couple more games because we are now down to plus sixes. I did hit my wall around a 220-ish, 230 points on this Jeff, so that's really not bad actually. And I don't mind having to finish off with a, a couple plus sixes. I've also got my fusion, my ultimate fusion as well. So this is going to be um, exciting to see who we get. Lana would be pretty cool. Uh, who else do I have? Is it... Sh no, it's not Shame. Yeah, it's Cesaro. I have Lana and Cesaro. Who do I really want? I would really want a Sheamus. Sheamus is who we want. What's... Yeah, Sheamus or Lana. Or anyone, really. I don't really mind who it is. But anyway, let's add some bouts. Um, I'm going to need to add... Um, oh, screw it. Just let's add five. It's a bit of a waste, but let's go for it. We um, we only need to do th four, uh, six, twelve, eighteen. We need to do four. Four plus six games. So, um, yeah, let's get those done right now. Okay, let's go with the tag team. Brock Lesnar, Cedric Alexander, they will tag. That is one point already. A little bit stressful coming down to these um, last couple games. Well, not really, but just like whether I lose or win. So I need to focus a little bit, but we're going to get this Jeff Hardy. I wanted to finish this whole RTG two days after it started, but we just didn't manage to do it, and it came down to the last day. But we are going to get them again. Uh, another another, another event gone, another event uh, successful, really, from me. So I'm happy with that. Hopefully we can keep on uh, this, uh, this good run of... Uh, of like, I haven't missed an event card since uh, Shane O'Mac. Yeah, Shane O'Mac is the uh, Shane O'Mac and Goldberg ultimate event cards are the only event cards I haven't got in season three yet. So, not bad. Hopefully, I can keep it going. And hopefully, the next event card is either Kurt Angle or a Diva. That's obviously what I want. Either Kurt Angle or a Diva will be fantastic. Uh, I'm not sure actually what I prefer between Kurt or. A diva event. Well, let me know what you, what, if you guys could, yeah, if you guys could choose what the next event would be. What would you guys have it be? Let me know in the comments if you could like just choose what the next event card would be. Um, and yeah, not a wrestler we've already had in an event either in Ultimate Tier or in WrestleMania Tier. If someone says, oh, I think we should have Shawn Michaels, or you know, that's not really gonna happen. So yeah, apart from the event card, what the wrestlers we've had on the event card so far, who would you like, guys? Who would you guys like to have? I was thinking of. Well, Kurt Angle, um, Eddie Guerrero, Edge, uh, that would be pretty cool. Uh, Ric Flair, Kurt Angle if I hadn't mentioned him already, Kurt Angle as well. <laughs> just, just Kurt Angle really, Kurt Angle all the way. But anyway, uh, are we on round three or round four? Oh no, that's it, this is the end of that game. Brilliant, that's like a 10-2 ten, ten win. 11-1 eleven, eleven maybe actually if we win this. No we don't, so yeah, 11-2 I think. 10-2, easy win. Easy, easy win, um, and now we are only three games away from this Jeff Hardy, which is going to be awesome. Can't wait to get them pro. They still don't have their animations in the game when they um, the Swanton and the Twist of Fades still aren't in the game. Hopefully they'll be in the game probably by the t when the new Ring Dom comes, the Ring Dom to announce the new event card. I'm guessing that's when they'll have the Hardys um, pro well proc animation. Their finisher added into the game. That'll be that's going to be really awesome to see, and looking forward to it. I'm not sure when I'm going to get them proed. Hopefully, I can get them proed. Uh, the Hardys, hopefully, in the next couple of days. I want to say the next couple of days, but every, you, you guys know me by now. It takes me a while to pro my event cards, but as long as I get them proed eventually, it should be fine. It's just the sooner I pro them, the sooner I can hopefully um, win some King of the Rings. You know, we really are looking to get into another final of a King of the Rings. So, you know, for you guys, for the rewards, it makes it interesting for you. It makes it interesting for me as well to be getting that extra WrestleMania card every, like, two days. Um, so, yeah, that would be really fantastic if we could get a uh, a win or a, or a final in the King of the Ring under our belts. That would be really helpful. So, anyway, 2-1. Uh, Let's go with that Seth Rollins. We're going to kind of, like, we know we're going to lose that. So... That's fine, and then it's a tag team, so we should be able to win it. I think we've got a WrestleMania 33 Pro in the tag team. Yeah, it's Brock Lesnar, and that is a win. Brilliant. I'm currently watching right now the El Clasico Real Madrid versus Barcelona. It's half time right now. Um, let me know what you guys. Let me know if you guys are watching it. It's 1-1. 
Brilliant goal from Messi, I'm going to admit that. You know, I'm, I'm rooting for Real Madrid all the way. Hopefully they can get the win in the second half. If they get this win, the three points from this game, they've pretty much won La Liga. So hopefully, hopefully they can go ahead and do it. That'd be really awesome. And also, also um, oh, there was who was it in my Discord who's a, uh, a Manchester City supporter? Whoever it is, man. I hope you enjoyed the game uh, this afternoon because I sure fucking enjoyed it. <laughs> Um, so for anyone who didn't, didn't follow the match, or doesn't really follow football, Arsenal battered Manchester City 2-1. They're going to the finals of the FA Cup. Brilliant performance. Wow, it was a good performance. It was good. Really good. I'm happy. I'm so happy with the result, as you guys can tell. And yeah, it's just made me happy. Hopefully Real Madrid can go ahead and win this match. And uh, I really won't be able to complain today uh, as far as football goes. And I got the hard, uh, and I got Hardy, so Jeff and Matt. Brilliant. <clears throat> Alright, that's another win for us. Try and get these games done. It's going to take a little bit of time if we uh, if we don't really get a move on. 5-4. Five, five, it's going to be quite close. We are going to get the win there. 6-4. I think we've got one more round to go as well. No, that's the end of the game. Brilliant. Two more games are left to go. And we have got Jeff Hardy. If I, if I could do a plus 10, that'd be that'd be so helpful, but I'm not going to risk it just because we lose, then we're just here for longer and it just doesn't change the outcome, and I might as well just play two games. I've got the bouts now left, uh, so yeah, two plus sixes left to do. Let's go and get the, let's go get one of them done for now, So I was actually thinking, like, really stupidly, I should put, like, Jeff, uh, not Jeff, Matt Hardy in the RTG while I was getting Jeff to get games played, and I was like, wait, that's so stupid, because then I'm going to lose... And that's going to be much harder. So, I didn't do it. I was thinking about doing it. Let me know if you guys do that. Or what is... How do people get... How do you guys get your event cards proed so quickly after they come out? Do you just grind wild mode and get them proed? Or do you guys put them in your RTG deck before, you know, while you're finishing the RTG? Or stuff like that. Or like in Ring Dom, if you're like... If, you know, when you get the WrestleMania 33 card, do you put that card in your Ring Dom deck while you're getting the event card? Something I could uh, think about doing more often because that would ha it would help out really, wouldn't it? It was then a question of will I lose in Ring Dom? It would probably be a good thing to do in RTG. It probably wouldn't be a great thing to do. That's that's how I'm, that's how I think at least. But yeah, let me know. So also, you guys all voted on the straw poll. Um, I will let you guys know right now the um, what how the polls are looking for my 5,000 subscribers special. Um, and yeah, it's from, I was I was kind of expecting this one to be top of the polls. So let me quickly read it out, guys. The straw poll is what should I do for 5,000 subs? The options were 12-hour live stream, triple challenge, which was the, the chili pepper one, the cinnamon challenge, and then a challenge of your guys choosing. One-hour YouTube video with shout-outs. The, the balloon video I did on my other other like on my other channel like two years ago already that so like lots of balloons in a room that that was on the list and then a Q and A slash a giveaway um, and the results are completely like fifty two percent of you guys all voted for a twelve hour live stream so uh, yeah that that's what we'll be doing for five thousand subscribers. So, congrats. well, it's pretty much guaranteed. We'll keep the straw polls in this. I'll put it in the description of this video again. Um, it'll be in my live streams when I stream. I'll give it to, like, when we hit 5,000. But it's looking like uh, the 12-hour live stream at this point is going to go ahead and win that straw poll. But, yeah, keep voting if that's not what you guys want. Um, yeah, get your voices heard. Well, <laughs> your votes. Your votes heard, at least. And, uh, yeah, if, even if it isn't, you know, what you wanted... You guys are still hopefully going to get something you'll enjoy. So we are currently losing this game, but it's only round three. We are losing 4-3. <laughs> um, let's go with that. That should win. It does win as well. Brilliant. Hopefully that... Oh, is it another event card? Was it Chris Jericho next to that Neville? I'm not too sure who it was. It was Mankind. Oh, it's power as well. Brilliant. And we proc. So does he, but we, we do manage to get the win. <clears throat> there we go. Good. And then that Nijax needs to win this. She does win it. Yeah, she does. Good. That should be the victory confirmed. And then we should be one game away from this Jeff Hardy. We'll go with speed. Yeah, I knew I, I, knew I was going to lose that. But it's just that way we got a tag team player player. That's going to lose. I'm pretty sure. No, that wins. What? Sorry about that. If you guys can hear that, I don't know what the hell my mic 
phone is doing. It's doing like zzz, it's really weird. I don't know. I don't know what's going on with it. <laughs> Uh, but that is a win, and that is the game over. Now we are one more game away from it. Let's go ahead and get it. It's been a while. It's taken a while. I've needed to grind, but we have finally come to it. Two event cards in one RTG. I mean, please don't... Well, do this again, definitely. Just make it easier in RTG, please. And uh, there's noise again. Don't know what to do. Okay. Nope. Can you stop? Can you stop? No, okay, there we go, no, that's so annoying, guys, sorry about that, if you guys can actually hear that. Okay, did not mean to open that, let's get back on Supercard. <laughs> Bit of a longer episode here, because um, I haven't played much gameplay recently, well, I have actually the RTG, but um, I wanted to just, yeah, I wanted to keep a little bit of, a little bit of gameplay for you guys, to, you know, when I get this Jeff Hardy. I will pro them in a video, of course, uh, show you guys how I token them and all of that before I pro them. I'm probably just going to do what I normally do, you know, just uh, max out their, what they proc in, their third best stat, and then whatever's left, put in their weaker stat, because now there's so many tokens, because the, well, these these WrestleMania cards go up to like level 50, so that's, that's great. Loads of tokens, you, you, can, you, you have what, uh, nine, I think, yeah, you have ten tokens, which is mad. So this game's already looking like a victory. We are 3-0 up in it. This is our last game as well. Already in round two. I wish it would have called a tag team there, but it doesn't. We are going to get the win on that one. So we're 4-0 already. This is going to be a win. Okay, uncom un un bleh bleh. uncompatible tag there. And we're going to lose, actually, against the two best ultimates in the game. And obviously they just had to tag, um, which is a bit silly. Oh, Real Madrid, Barca has just kicked off again. Come on. It's been it's been a very good match actually so far. Lots of fouls, lots of well, not not actually that much from Barca, but like it's just been it's been very tense. You can see like a couple fouls actually from Barca, which you know, a little bit in there, like that Umtiti one, um and a couple fouls from Real Madrid. Casemiro's luck kinda luck well, again, like argue uh, it's arguable if those fouls. But yeah, it's on a yellow card been 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 going in a bit heavy, but yeah, if you guys are watching this match, again, please let me know what you guys think about it. Tweet, tweet it at me, the scores, all that. Uh, if, if any of you guys do like the football and uh, keep up to date with the results, I, uh, I sometimes I post things on Twitter. Anyway, uh, let's go with that Shawn Michaels. Oh, that's a win. So I'm going to try and keep an eye on the match uh, while we finish this. But I, I didn't think it was going to take this long. I should have only left like two games of RTG. I left a bit too many, but it's okay. Hope you guys do enjoy the long episodes. Maybe that way you guys grind as well alongside with me. That's what I. That's what a lot of people do. I think. Oh, oh, counter attack here for Real Madrid. Oh, corner. Okay, that was, that was good. That was really decent. <laughs> okay, we lose that, but it's seven three. I'm gonna go charisma James Ellsworth. We beat Samoa over James Ellsworth. I love it. Love it. And then power, we get the win there with Jack Gallagher. And we get the... No, I don't know. I think we lose that. I actually think we do. No, we win. Okay, brilliant. Brilliant, that's okay then. And there we go. There is Jeff Hardy as soon as the waiting on the network is over. Come on. Come on, game. There we go. There is Jeff Hardy complete get in guys get in brilliant really happy with that okay hopefully imagine if we got a WrestleMania 33 pool here the Miz would be pretty cool <laughs> as, we, as we got him uh, in the RTG or any any pro would be cool to be fair um, and we don't even get a board reset okay that's that's fine that's fine because we got Jeff Hardy let me go quickly lock him in and then we're gonna go and claim that fusion oh what a shot was that Cruz? Oh, God. Sorry, it's really so hard to record while trying to watch a football match. But anyway, here's the fusion, guys. This is probably what you guys have been waiting for more than me just playing some RTG. Who are we going to get? Give me Sheamus. You gave me. That's... No, it's an elite fusion, you complete idiot. <laughs> you idiot. It's an elite fusion. I kept... I kept saying ultimate, didn't I? 
It's an elite fusion. I am an idiot. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> it doesn't really matter, I suppose, but yeah. Um, well, except I built it up as an ultimate and it wasn't, but yeah. I, I personally don't mind, you know, it's not. We'll just get an ultimate when we get our ultimate. Okay, so let's see what we can get into this fusion chamber. Let's go and unlock a couple ultimate cards, I think. Ultimate enhancements. So we're already on enhancements. Unlock, 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 and unlock. We've unlocked a lot, um, but I'm not sure how many it is, and I prefer to unlock a lot than have not enough, and then have to re-go, go back on thing, and then unlock some more. So, Dash Wilder. I didn't even mention it, but yeah, we got a Dash Wilder. Um, doesn't really matter who I got. Let's go enhancements. Boom. Boom, and one more. Ah, you see, we needed one more. I unlocked one too many, and it's a little bit overkill, but I don't really mind. Let's go and confirm that. And we'll go back onto my cards, go back onto that enhancement that I unlocked. So we've definitely got enough for a quite, you know, couple more uh, big fusions. So that's really good on the fusion food aspect of things. That's going to be our third uh, ultimate fusion as well. So when WrestleMania fusions come out, we'll have enough to do a couple. Uh, straight off the bat. Thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. Sorry about that whole ultimate elite fusion mix up. I really thought it was an ultimate fusion. Don't know why though, but it was only an elite. I'll bring you guys the ultimate fusion in a week. Six days. No, in six days. <laughs> anyway, drop a like on the video if you have enjoyed it guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Until then, peace out. Most importantly, take care.